five-foot fishing vessel Southern Monarch fought a shipboard fire in the pre-dawn hours off Malibu this morning, then were safely evacuated to a sister ship nearby and watched their ship sink beneath the waves. The Coast Guard said it received the first distress signal from the troubled ship at 6.10 this morning. When they arrived on the scene, the ship was well involved in flames. Although they were able to extinguish the blaze topside, they were unable to control the blaze below decks. The crewmen were taken off safely and returned to San Pedro, where the concerned families of the crewmen were waiting anxiously for their return. Our John North standing by in San Pedro tonight with further details. John? Well, as you say, I'm here at Fish Harbor. The St. Christina, the boat that took aboard the 11 crew members, has just pulled out. She's taking part of the Monarch's net over to another area. I'm with some of the family members. As you say, it was an emotional greeting with the family members waiting here anxiously on the dock, waiting for the men to come back in. Here you see the Christina. Here's some of the meeting as the families greet each other. Fishing, of course, is at best a risky business. And this, of course, had a happy ending, at least as far as the fact that none of the people were injured. With me is the co-owner of the boat and Captain Pete Russo. Pete? But I'd like to thank the skipper and the San Cristina and the crew to help us and have the patient to stay with us. Well, we're glad, all of us are glad that you're all okay. And thank you, Captain. There will be an investigation, of course. The Coast Guard is beginning an investigation, but the Monarch is in about 600 feet of water and may never know exactly what happened aboard that. Now back to you. Thank you. We were on caught fire and sank off the Malibu coast. The first SOS from the commercial fishing boat, the Southern Monarch, was received shortly after 6 this morning. Another fishing boat was nearby and it rushed to the scene. The Coast Guard arrived a few minutes after that. Crew members and the Coast Guard attempted to put the fire out, but the flames had spread too far and the boat had to be abandoned. However, the crew was able to save the Southern Monarch's expensive fishing net. The exact cause of the fire is not known, but fortunately, nobody was hurt. The city of Signal fishing boat, Southern Monarch, is sitting at the bottom of the ocean off Malibu tonight. An early morning fire sank the ship with 60 tons of Spanish mackerel aboard. Fortunately, all 11 crew members escaped injury. Southern Monarch on its way home to San Pedro when fire broke out in the engine room. Evidently, the fire hit the electrical system immediately, and that made it impossible to radio for help. Two other boats in the area, though, saw the blaze and called in the Coast Guard. The 11 crewmen aboard the Monarch managed to escape on their skiff, but they had to leave all their belongings behind on the burning ship. Most of us lost in our uh, wallet. Uh, we shut the fire once, we pulled the CO2, and everything was uh, looked like we were under control. All of a sudden, everything blew up again. And uh, then not even the Coast Guard could shut it off. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. There she goes. There she goes. Hello. Goodbye. That's all. There she goes. There she goes, the Monarco. Monarco. Ciao. Seeing a ship sink is a terrible sight. The boat was loaded down with 60 tons of Spanish mackerel caught last night off the Santa Barbara coast. The Southern Monarch was headed for home in San Pedro when the fire started. Nine crewmen were sleeping down below when the man on watch spotted the flames and woke up the others. All managed to escape aboard their skiff, but had no time to gather their belongings. The Southern Monarch's electrical system went out immediately and they could not radio for help. Fortunately, two other fishing boats were in the area and called the Coast Guard at 6.10 this morning. The crewmen were picked up by the St. Christina. Oh, everybody's all right. The crew's all right. Everybody's okay. Yeah, everybody's okay. The 175-foot Coast Guard buoy tender Walnut and two cutters responded to the call, but the Southern Monarch was well involved in flames when they arrived. For about two and a half hours, the Coast Guard tried to put out the fire and salvage what it could from the Southern Monarch. Then, all of a sudden, there was concern the fishing boat would explode. The Coast Guard backed off, and flames quickly covered the boat's deck. A few hundred yards away, all the crew of the Southern Monarch could do was watch as their fishing boat slowly burned, then sank in about 2,000 feet of water. There it goes. There she goes. Hello. Attention to the Goodbye. to the There she goes. There she goes, the Monarch. Monarch. Most of the Italian crew members have been fishing on the Southern Monarch for years.